So what I have is uh, one of my bottom tapes, and I'm just going to trim that so it fits behind the ear. So we have a, a double sticky tape. Just place that behind. And that gives us just a little bit of extra tension on that area. So it's pulling everything all the way back. You could also put another uh, piece of tape over the top of this, which we probably will do that at the end. But you can see we've got a nice uh, curvature there. And then I'm going to place the former inside. Okay. I'm going to take just a, a piece of a micro, micro pore that you can also uh, find uh, smaller rolls of these in your kit. place that right over the base here. This is also uh, helpful to use the tape like this to uh, keep the little ones from getting their fingers. If you have a very active child, this will actually help them from uh, getting their fingers up, up underneath there and pulling that uh, cradle off. Now what I've done with the Conchal um, Former is you can see that I've actually taken one of the um, one of the foams and I clipped it down so it fits around the back of the former because I want to increase that uh, pressure uh, to open that up as much as we can. I'm actually going to use a cotton swab to kind of get that in there. But in this way we're able to get all of that um, open and we've created enough back pressure on here that and again that's foam so that's not going to be hard pressure but everything's fit nice and snug and I'm going to add a little bit of uh, foam to the top of that too because as you can see it wants to roll forward because of that uh, pressure but again the goal is not to create too much pressure just enough so that we can get the last finishing touches on this Okay, so a little bit back here, nicely tucked in there, and then that uh, foam on the top is going to hold it nice and steady.